How's it going everyone? JKXVX here, back on Forza Horizon 4 once again. It's time for another update information video. I have just finished watching the live stream containing all of the information for the new features and the new cars that are going to be coming in update 24, which releases this week. So today's video, I'm going to tell you everything about the new cars, what the new cars are, what the new feature is, because it's a new big feature, and then everything else you need to know. As always guys, if this video does help you out, please do consider subscribing to the channel. It helps out massively and I like to keep you up to date with information. Now the first thing I'm gonna tell you about this update is the new feature as the new cars are sort of linked to that feature. Now the new feature is called Photo Challenges and this is an extra addition sort of a feature obviously to the festival playlist as you can see on screen right now this is one of the festival playlists this is winter and um, which is three weeks from now and as you can see there is an extra box now which has photo challenges and basically every week we will be given a certain instruction on a type of photo to be taken for example this one is take a photo of any lamborghini beside the lighthouse and as you can see on screen, when you do this, it will give you a completion thing. You just take it like a normal photo and then you will be given a reward and some XP for doing that. So we get one of these challenges per week in the festival playlist. That'll be four of them per month. This one is winter's um, photo challenge, as you can see, just as an example. But that is the new feature that will be releasing this Thursday with the first week of the new festival playlist. What I'm going to do now is show you the whole festival playlist which contains four of the new cars which are coming this month. So for the whole series starting Thursday for the next month, for 50% for the full thing you can get the Caddy Limo and then at 80% the Lamborghini Huracan Performante, that's finally returning. And then for the first week, which starts this Thursday in a couple of days, which is summer, at 50% you can get the Koenigsegg Agera, and then at 80% the Porsche 917 LH, the kind of a longer version. And then, as you can see on screen, the first new car, which you actually get for completing the photo challenge, which will be super easy to do, you will unlock, as you can see, the Zenvo TSR S the brand new car this week. It's the car that's in the thumbnail of this video and that is one of the four new cars coming this month. Now on to the second week, which is autumn, which starts next Thursday. At 50% you can get the McLaren 12C, at 80% you can get the Rossi in Q1, and then in an exclusive championship you can get the second new car for this month, the Ford GT70 from 1970. That is the second new car this month. The third new car, which we get in winter, you may have saw a glimpse of it earlier, at 50% completion, you can get the Ford Escort Mark II from 1977. This is the third new car this week, 50% in winter, and then at 80% in winter, you can get the RTR Mustang. Now the final week, which is spring, which is three and a bit weeks from now, 50% you can get the 04 Honda Civic, at 80% completion the Crown Victoria, that's a pretty cool addition to see. And then in an exclusive championship, the fourth new car for this week, sorry this month, the Mazda RX-7 1985. That is the fourth and final new car that we're getting this month. Now the cool thing about this month is we got every single Tormund Tuesday clue correct. As you would have seen last week, we guessed all of the clues from Torben Tuesday and as a community, not just myself, as a community, we guessed the Zembo, the Ford GT70, the Mazda and the Ford Escort as well. We guessed them all correctly, so well done for that. Torben Tuesday was bob on this month. And it seems like this month is going to be pretty easy to unlock the cars as well. The Zembo is going to take minutes to unlock. The Ford and the Mazda are going to be super easy to unlock as well. It's just one championship instead of having to get to 50%. But those are the new cars and that is the new festival playlist for this month's update. Now as for updates and fixes wise, there weren't really any other things that they did. They fixed a few bugs like one of the achievements wasn't working like the stay at home one and a couple of other bits, but nothing worth mentioning. Now they did actually talk about what happened last month with update 23. As many of you will know, the update 23 got delayed for two weeks because of an issue that they found. And they actually clarified that the issue that they found was once the update was finished, they finished it, they finished the testing, they realized that 
it caused some, sometimes caused the game to not load on some platforms. And the annoying thing was this only happened on retail games. It didn't happen on their kind of developer versions of the game. So it was really hard for them to figure out why it, why it kept crashing, why it was broken, because um, it didn't happen on their machines. So that's what happened with Update 23, and they just sort of said sorry for it being delayed for two weeks, but doesn't bother me. But that's about it for update 24. That's everything you need to know. The new feature and all of the new cars. The update is releasing this week and the new cars will start this Thursday. If this video has helped you out, please do consider subscribing to the channel. Leave a like if you've enjoyed and I'll see you all later.